I thought I would wear my fake glasses because why not? It's my own fashion statement of a sort. I, I, I don't know. Hello friends! I am Mitchell. It is Thursday and I am really bored. I have not done an iPhone vlog in about two years. Like, it was on one of my old channels that I deleted and this is really shaky. I just realized, I'm sorry, <laughs> not my hand. Um, yeah, I haven't done an iPhone video in two years. That's a long time. And I decided, why not give you a tour of my humble abode? And by humble, I mean an apartment building. Okay, so I have a home, which is good. Always a plus, right? Um, why? This is a terrible start. Okay, um, so we're gonna start over at the entrance. You walk in, and what, uh, what accompanies you? What? I don't know. Uh, closet. <laughs> Great. A mirror, uh, poster, Scott Pilgrim. Awesome, by the way. And our shoe rack. Oh, by the way, I live with my sister. I've been going in for about four months, I think. I don't know. I don't remember. It's something like that. It's good. It's great. Go us. Um, go family. And we have our recycling bin over here, because we are so earthly eco-friendly. Why is there earthly in there? I don't know. Uh, we have a crap shelf. Or, or crap. <laughs> great. And our key bowl. And behind this door is the super exciting place of laundry. Yeah, I know. Laundry's so much fun, right? Sure. Um, so then we have, we walk down the hallway. You got all the posters here. Great, great. And then we walk down the hallway and we accompany, why do I keep saying that word? I'm sorry. Uh, we walk right into the bathroom. My bathroom is boring. I really want to get a new shower curtain because this one's really blah and I don't like it. So I really want to get a new one. Hopefully soon. We'll see what happens with that. Um, yeah. So then you walk past the hallway, bathroom, whatever. I don't know. Um, you walk past the bathroom and uh, encounter. Encounter. That's the word I was looking for. My goodness. That was painful. <laughs> Um, this is the linen closet with all our linens and things. Get it? I don't know if they had that in the States. But in Canada, we had this place called Linens and Things. And it does not exist anymore. So, my funny fun is stupid. <laughs> um, <laughs> great. Um, so I'm gonna turn off these lights to conserve energy. Because, yeah. Uh, okay, great start. Um, so then, we come into my room, which is filled with a bunch of random crap. Um, you've seen the layout of my room in my videos. You know what it looks like from this angle. You know, you know that angle, but you don't know this angle. So, um, I'll do a quick review. These are the paintings. I actually made these a few years ago. Uh, this one was in grade 8, grade 9, and this was just because I had a paint by number, and I wanted to finish it. <laughs> Great. Um, so then we have my IKEA clock sponsor. Not really. Um, here we have an Adventure Time poster. Well, let me get on that, because, wow. Um, I got it at the Comic Expo when I went in April, and it was awesome, by the way. And I want to go next year, if I can even afford that. <laughs> um, and then we have my little table filled with random, randoms. Um, I actually realized that when I started this video, I forgot to put away these boxes. Um, these are actually for future videos that I'll be making. Um, if you've ever heard of Poppin' Cookin', um, they come from Japan and they're these little, like, food making kits. Like, they have burgers, they have cake, and... Uh, pizza and all these random I'm having okay what's happening um, they have all these random little food making kits and I'm actually going to be uploading the first one on Tuesday next week so that will be amazing right um, apology in advance the camera angles were really bad I'm sorry 
And I'm also sorry if the video goes on for too long because I took my time. Because I wanted to make it nice. That did not happen. <laughs> okay. Um, and you also probably saw this little pile I have of Starbucks cards. Um, since I work at Starbucks, I'm a barista. Um, at Christmas, they had released these brand new Starbucks cards. And they were all, like, so cool. Like, there were ones with, like, initials and locations and all these really awesome things. And I've collected about this many, plus the pile I just showed you, and I'm trying to find as many new ones as I possibly can. I just have to purge through them, but it's a weird collection I have. <laughs> Great. So then we come over to my board of something. I don't know. Um, here are all my con official concert tickets I've been to. Um, we got Said the Whale, Broken Bells, Black Keys, Mother Mother, OK Go, Imagine Dragons, yeah. Um, I have my X-Fest, um, wristband pass thing, um, and my X-Fest, X-Fest, uh, VIP pass. So, this, uh, that's the music portion of it. Um, here's when I went to Universal Studios last year, um, I took a bunch of pictures, and then one day we had w went to the mall, and they had this a Polaroid photo bar thing, um, I don't know if you've heard of it, but if you have, basically what you can do is you can go inside and they have a bunch of these computers lined up and basically what you do is you send these pictures to an email on the computer and then you can actually get these pictures printed on cardboard Polaroids and it's like honestly one of the coolest things I've ever seen. I wish we had them in Canada because I would order 1200 million of them because <laughs> I, I take a lot of photos. Um, so then uh, we have a picture of me ne meeting Neil Patrick Harris. I know, right? Um, yeah, that also happened at Comic Expo. It was a last minute appearance. It was like the day before and he was like, Oh, I'm gonna be here. Yeah, I'm here. <laughs> um, so that happened. Um, I have my picture, if you've ever seen the Avengers or Captain America. Uh, this is a uh, Agent Peggy Carter. So I got to meet her as well at Comic Expo, which was really awesome. Um, but yeah, that's my weird little board thing. I don't know. Um, you know, I've decorated my room with twinkly Christmas lights. I just think that's a great way to light the atmosphere, you know? Mm -hmm. Um, so then here we have my TV. Yeah, I know. Really disproportionate to the room. I'm sorry. But deal with it. Uh, it's a smart TV that I got on Boxing Day. We went at 6 a.m., because I found this as a last-minute deal, and it was just too good to pass up. So, I got that. Yay. I love it. Um, then we have my shelf of everything. So we got a uh, TV on the first two middle shelves. We have my CDs. Yes, I collect CDs. Deal with it. Um, and then these bottom two here are movies. This is just a random shelf of crap. I don't really know what that is. <laughs> and here we have kind of my gaming um, area. I don't know. Uh, and then we have a bin of random crap. I'm not going to open that because there's way too much in there. And if I open that, I'm going to look through everything. And you're going to be watching a video that's two hours long. And nobody wants that. So, great. Uh, then over here, we kind of have... Um, I don't really know what this is, but it's this. <laughs> so we have a bunch of stuffy things. Uh, we have a minion, another minion. <laughs> um, I got some lemon drops from Honey Dukes when I went to Universal. Uh, I got some potions, uh, potions. Um, I got the Birdie Bots Every Flavored Beans. If you watched my first official comeback vlog on this channel, I do the Birdie Bots Taste Test Challenge. It's awful. Great. Um, then I also got this stuff at Comic Expo. It's kind of a little Mario kit. I don't know. Uh, you got a coin. You got Toad. Oh, that was actually separate, but I have a little Toad figurine. Uh, some pipes. Not actually, like, not pipes, but, like, Mario pipes. That's not helping. Uh, and a Goomba. And then I have a chocolate frog. And a giant stuffy Beemo. Great. And then I have the thing that makes all my videos possible. That. 
Great. Um, yeah. So then we have uh, my nightstand with a lamp for vision. Um, my iPhone, iPod, dock, music, player, charger, radio thing with a view. I don't a what? Um, and then we have my little Minecraft thing with TNT and a creeper. Awesome. Um, a little Minion USB drive. I know. Right? <laughs> um, a candle for no apparent reason. I felt like I wanted one, just in case. <sighs> oh, well. <laughs> uh, my iPod Touch from when I did my unboxing. I still haven't put the box away. Yeah. Uh, my remote for my TV. And my iPhone for phoning things. Um, the reason there's not a case on it, I usually do keep a case on it. I am very protective of my phone because well, what happened to my last phone was I dropped it on the kitchen floor. Um, and then three hours later, I was just watching TV and all of a sudden I heard this little like chipping noise. And I look at my phone, and there's a giant crack right through the middle of it. So, I've been really persistent on having a case on my phone, because I'm terrified that I'm going to break it. So, great. I would look... I'm looking for that phone. I'm not going to find it. So, I'm just going to not go into that. <laughs> great. Um... And then we have a, a bed for sleeping with no one. Um, what? Oh, that went to a wrong place. <laughs> um, we have my YouTube pillow that I recently got. My One of my favorite things that I purchased this year. Um, then I have my two posters. One of a Minecraft world, which I find honestly so cool looking. It's just so artistic and awesome. And then I have a giant BMO, which is just great. Then I have a closet full of random crap, clothes, and anything else that eh, no one really cares about. Great. So now we go into the open room. Um, so here's a kitchen um, where I cook cereal. Um, we have a fridge full of watermelon. <laughs> Great. Um, yeah, watermelon season. It's the best. Um, we have cupboards filled with... No dishes. I uh, Nutribullet. Sponsor. Um, and then we have my little Starbucks bar of my own. So I made, I took the liberty of purchasing actual syrups from my work. I have vanilla, classic, and I have a toffee nut syrup in my pantry. I just need to find a syrup pump for it. Um, but yeah, I've had those for... A couple of months, and it's honestly like the most handy thing to have at home, especially making iced coffee or hot coffee or anything. It's great. Um, coming from the pro, obviously. Um, so then I have my milk frother. I don't really use this in the summer because it's too hot. Um, I don't actually drink hot coffee in the summer. I normally just do an iced coffee. It's easy, it's quick, and it's delicious. Um, more in the winter, that's when I use that. That's actually when I got it, so... Yeah. Um, then I have my Keurig, which I got for Christmas uh, as well. I love it. It is perfect for me, I think. And then I have my little coffee shelf. So I keep all my Keurig pods in this these drawers. Oh, no. Oh, no. I'm breaking everything. Oh, my God. What is happening? I can't do this. Are you kidding me? What? <laughs> Oh my god, I'm breaking the internet. Oh my god, what is happening? <laughs> I need to fix this because I have issues of my own. Okay, can you like function? <laughs> this has never done this before, I swear. Okay, what the butt? Um. I'm having technical difficulties. Oh, oh, God. Oh, no. This is bad. This is bad. <laughs> Get in there. My goodness. Okay, that was painful. Um, <laughs> then we have the other side of the kitchen, which you've probably seen. What? Uh, you saw on Tuesday when I made a ravioli. So I could chicken it out. Yeah. Um, <laughs> yeah. And then this is our living room. 
because you can see so much of it right now. Um, we have a door that leads to nowhere. Um, this is my dad's TV. Isn't it great? Um, a poster from American Horror Story, because that show is TheBomb.com. <laughs> I light, because vision, again. Um, air conditioner, great. Uh, some record players that are my sister's, because she likes music. And mini fridge for all of our beverages. And by beverages, I mean Sprite. <laughs> great. Um, I want to show you our outside. Um, this is our patio. Yeah, we usually leave this door closed because it is very loud on our street and we don't like hearing people, so. You can just hear it. It's insanely loud. I don't like it, but I also don't mind it. I tend to just tune the sound out after a certain point and it's like, yeah, what am I hearing? Not that. Um, great. Uh, did, was I covering the camera? I can't tell. It's too bright out. Um, so we have just a table, our... That's all. <laughs> a beautiful view of the vape emporium. I don't even know if you, hold on. I don't even know if you can see that. That this um, this tree is completely blocking everything. But across the street they built this new plaza. And right there uh, they built the vape emporium. Great, right? Yeah. In such a child friendly neighborhood. <laughs> You're welcome. Um, so, yeah, that is the tour of my house. Um, there's another room, but it's my sister's room. We're not going to go in there because it's not mine, and she would beat the crap out of me. So, great. I'm going to lock that later because their door's stupid. Um, yeah, so that's my house. You're welcome. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed this uh, vlog. Um, if you want me to do more of these, let me know by giving a thumbs up or leaving a comment down below. I need to know what people like to decide what people like. I, sure. Um, I'm gonna go. You all have good lives. Sure. And, and adios to the miggles. Woohoo!